Good morning everyone, welcome to my channel. So in today's video, I'm gonna be vlogging my Bali trip. So I was supposed to go like two days ago and as I was packing, I looked at my passport and I realized there's only literally like three months left and you have to have six months valid on your passport to be able to fly to Bali. So I had to apply for like a priority passport. I paid like $600, went in and got my photo and it was ready the next day, but um, there was no flights yesterday, so here we are today, going three days late. <laughs> I've had a bit of FOMO looking at everyone's stories. It looks really fun. Um, so yeah, today I'm flying to Bali, Bindi. By the way, my house is kind of a little bit more put together. This is my bedroom. I mean, there's still a lot of things to organize, but that's all right. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, I bought these for myself. Just thought I'd show you because treat yourself. I'll miss you. Um, Benny doesn't let me put on outfits because she doesn't move when she has clothes on. So Peanut's the only one with an outfit on. Little ducks on it. <laughs> Love you. Love you so much. Thomas is watching Fortnite. What's new? while I've been in Melbourne ever since I moved here, ever since my moving vlog. How crazy. So I guess you're gonna get a little bit of Melbourne at the start of this vlog before I head off to Bali. Oh girl. I'm just gonna get my nails done now. Um, I was gonna just do it on the way, but like there's literally, I think there's places like around my house. So I might just like, just drive down the main road and just like see what's popping, see what's around. Hopefully it's good. I literally never go to one nail salon. I just go to like random places. So that's always a nice moment. Yeah, so this morning I went and got my lashes done. Like I do all the time by my friend Eloise here in Melbourne. And um, I got in the shower when I got home and just wet my face. And I'm like, holy fuck, you're not supposed to wet your face for like 48 hours after you get your lashes done. So I really hope they don't fall out. That's like the number one rule. <laughs> Anyways, going to get my nail fixed. This is the before. Wow. Hi right, guys, so I just got home. Um, I did some emails and stuff while I was getting my nails done. So I got some stuff done, but this is what my nails look like. Little nuts, I look like little almond nuts. <laughs> they're so much better, I just feel better now that they're done. I'm in my Uber now, just heading to the airport. Um, I hope I have everything. All I know is I have my brand new, fresh looking passport. So I'm excited for everyone to look at that and be like, you're so cute. <laughs> <laughs> okay guys, so I'm finally here in Byron Bay. We've got Rani here. She's got a new dance she does. Every time there's a camera on you, I've noticed you've done that. No, every time I get drunk. Did I say Byron Bay? <laughs> Sorry, Sorry, we're in Bali. Every it's time I get drunk, I go. I know, and now you're doing it sober, which I think is a problem. <laughs> love your work, love your work. <laughs> um, so last night I got in at like 10 o'clock. And there was actually a bit of um, a bit of an issue, I'd say. There was a slight issue. <laughs> Michael, a issue. Michael was supposed to wait for me um, at this villa, which, by the way, very cute, stunning, very swag. And um, turns out he was too hungry to wait for me, or that he Fuck forgot. Fucking ate my dinner, didn't he? <laughs> <laughs> he was too. No, he forgot about me or something. So I landed at the airport, and I was like, "How am I supposed to get into the villa? I don't have a key." And he's like, "Oh, well, I'm eating. What do you mean?" And I'm like, "All right, I'm just gonna sit on the corner of the street." Oh, I thought you were naked. I was like, shit. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, they ended up coming home for me, and I was like, okay, I'm great. Bag. Thank you. You braid my bag. True friends. Wait, that's the first time. Wait, I'm coming to watch. This is funny. <laughs> Ronnie never wears my clothes. So we have Bella. Say hello. Yes, I'm vlogging. We have Amy. So everyone was just doing the rounds of photos. This is what we're working with. That's a fun moment. Ronnie, I just don't think you're going to have any luck on. Love this. That's yours with Beginning Boutique. Nice plug. No, I'm kidding. So Michael has a drip in his arm because he's getting a bit sick. He's got like vitamin D and B and all that because he's got the bug. Um, he's got some food delivered. And um, he's going home today. He's not letting me put his face in it. <laughs> okay. I just want everyone to know what's been happening before I got to you. What have you been doing? Um, okay, Monday. And now it's Thursday, I so... I lost my bag the first Fuck night. off. Mm -hmm. <laughs> my bag, Mark Skinner. Shout out to you, brother. 
picked up, we had like have the exact same identical bags and he picked up my bag and fucking jetted off away with my bag. Oh like, yeah. Oh, so when he was at the airport, someone took his suitcase mm. because they had the same like Not someone, Mark Skinner. That's his name. <laughs> Find him. I'm like, look. Wait, so you've got it and he- Use your fucking eyes next time. <laughs> Um, so I heard as well last night, or not last night, the night before, um, Rani got so drunk that she was like vomiting in- Oh my god, I don't know if we should actually say this in the vlog, like it's a bit much. Oh, true. Like she was literally dead in the pool. We were like, hello. She jumped in the pool and was like, oh yeah, it's probably too far, isn't it? Mm, so Rani was like, okay, Rani had like 15 drinks and like, let me just tell you, when she drinks, she can only have like three. Yeah. And so it's she like- she decides to have 15. Right, 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 Mexi Cola on the tables, <gasps> absolutely blind. Oh, that's and she's just so sitting funny. there like, <gasps> like passing out. Oh my god! Like, go. See what I missed out on, guys. I'm mm. so sad. I'm actually really happy that I got a new passport photo, though. <laughs> Maybe this happened for a reason because my my passport photo before was really rank. Yeah, it was pretty heinous. And I look quite quite good in my new one. And it literally came in one day. So we're just at the first cafe of the trip. What's it called? Oh, it's called Shady Shack. Um, they're just gonna get something in there. Um, because we're going out and drinking soon. I want to get like an immunity shot because everyone like, literally has barley belly so I'm going to make sure to stay on top of it. Get something nice and healthy and you'll probably see in the next frame I've got like hot or something. Ah. Yum, I just got a um, protein smoothie. It tastes so amazing. It has almond milk as well. I've just switched over to almond milk so I don't get acne. Goodbye. And then we have some immunity booster uh, shots. There you go, Bindi. They don't know I got it for oh them. God. Hello? No, that's yours. All in one. Yeah. If you can, but maybe put it in two. Yeah. Yeah. Just like try and do a big job. It tastes like grass. What do you reckon? This is alright. If that doesn't save my barley belly, I don't know what will. Thank you. Ryan just got a coffee with ice in it, so I'm just gonna laugh when she starts shitting out. Dogs and cats. <laughs> got myself an open omelet. Yum. And the girls got um, what is that? Banana oats. Brian just asked if she can have my food for a photo. How about eat my dog? Thank you. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I nearly fell. <laughs> so we're just popping into the grocery store to get some oh shit. <laughs> to get some water and some alcohol, I think. And anything in case I get by the belly. Are they dicks? Oh my god, they look like cherries. I love that. Quick haul! This is what I'm gonna live up for the next week. So we've got some Oreos, worms, noodles, peanuts, all my waters. Apparently this is really good for when you're hung, so it's time to go drink, Indy. So, um, we're just stopping in at Finn's and um, we just said we're going to the toilet, but really we're coming in for a shot. We're literally getting a shot. Yeah, because no one else. Well, um, M. Davies, boyfriend Jake, is allowed in here because um, he has a tattoo on his neck. So we're like, okay, we're just going to the toilet. Thank you. Um, but really we're here having a cafe yeah. Patron shot, so. Not a vibe, Finn's no, it's angry. A vibe. It's a vibe. It's a vibe, it's a vibe, but I'm pissed off. Don't discriminate. the alcohol stop I know but like I might get a bit peckish later why do you have a lemon in your neck because I have no more arms please open my bag <laughs> I would but I don't have any either <laughs> I love that I just need my bag open <laughs> oh all right so we're just gonna make our way over to a house party now which I've never been in Bali which I'm also scared about which I'm also really nervous about but that's okay hello guys so it is the next day right now um, we're just going to breakfast you're literally gonna get run over oh my god I'm literally ah! help ah! help Indy yeah anyway so um, we just want to get some breakfast right now oh we're gonna eat kind yay so we have um, half the squad left because majority has gone home because they're sick or they've 
We're just going home early. Oh my god, Lily got stuck. Anyways, so last night ended on a very fun note. I think we got home at like midnight or something, so that was good. I'm not hungover, I'm feeling great. It's Lily's birthday today, so I'm excited to just eat so much food. Everyone's just gone around the table and taken some photos, but we just got our three to have three hash browns. Oh my god, this is so good. I had it last time. Wow. Oh. So good, and then I got a tropical juice as well. So that was a fun moment, but I'm just so excited to eat. I don't think you guys understand. So we're just gonna get some massages now. I asked Louie to come in my room with me, <laughs> so um, I'm very excited. I just took my makeup off. So when I lay my face in the bed, what are you doing? <laughs> um, I don't know, but you know when you usually get massages, you have a hole to put your face in. I just don't know how we're gonna breathe, but I'm very excited to have this massage. Like you have no idea. <laughs> He's like, your hair looks really weird, and I did. Fucking Dragon Ball Z. Oh my god, my nipple. Um, yeah, I did not expect, but this is, this is what we're working with. That was so good. Oh my god, did you love that? I loved it. All oh right, god. so we're at dinner. Oh my god, we have our balls. I'm so excited to eat my balls. Oh my god. The lights are going down. It's getting moody in here. I've got some. Uh, potato puree, and I don't know what this is, and I'm really disappointed. So I'm gonna steal some of Lewis's food. No, you're not. Is it lamb it's or? A big fat, uh, no. <laughs> what about yours? Absolutely not. Fuck. Put it out. Why would sharing with me? My boobs keep slipping out of this, and I'm really sad about it, but it's really cute. So. Hello, everyone. So it has escalated slightly. So everyone wants to stay home, and then all of a sudden. Yeah, you are. You've obviously got bad eyes. You're being a creep. I'm going upstairs. Finally just got home and obviously Peanuts jumped on the bed and the camera's moving. Um, the last clip you saw was me at a club called Lawn. I thought I saw a spider. There's so many spiders in this house. It's actually not normal. They're coming out of like the vents of the, the light vents. It's like really creepy. But Peanut, can you stop moving the camera? <laughs> He's licking it. Peanut! Are you having mummy's home? Yeah, you are. Yeah, you are. Yeah. Okay, but seriously, I have to tell you what happened um, after I was filming that part of the video. So, everyone was like getting drunk. It was Lily's birthday. The whole point of this vlog was to like celebrate her 21st birthday. So, obviously, there was a lot of drink drinking involved and stuff. Um, if you're wondering why that was happening a lot, it was literally based around like celebrating her 21st. So, um,. I went to the bar and I'm always the type of person that's like, oh, like, let's, like, everyone, let's get drunk, let's have a good time. I'm always that person that's, like, motivating everyone to drink. I don't know if that's a good thing, don't know if that's a bad thing. I just like to be a good vibe. I can't believe this happened to me. I was, like, waiting at the bar. I ordered my cafe. I actually hadn't even ordered yet. I'm just staying there, like, being patient. Something drops on my shoulder and I'm like, what the fuck? Because it was, like, a really, like, heavy bang on my shoulder. It wasn't heavy, but, like, I could, I could almost hear the splat on my shoulder. I looked, I, like, looked like this and there was a fucking cockroach on my shoulder and I looked behind me and I was like who just threw that on me I was like are you actually kidding me like is this a joke is this a prank what is actually happening I look up at the roof and it's like all bamboo sticks I'm like no one's behind me that could have possibly put a cockroach on there I would like to hope not so I'm looking up and like I'm just thinking how is it possible that a cockroach has landed on my shoulder from the bamboo sticks on the roof this bar is literally so big and it landed on my shoulder so I literally screamed and I like went like this it landed in my bag right in front of me and then um, someone like was flicking my bag and it like went on the floor and then someone squished it and it's like white guts went everywhere on the floor and I'm like, I almost don't want to do this shot anymore. Like this is honestly a joke. Um, so I went over and I was like telling everyone and I got another friend and we went over to the bar again. I'm like, yeah, let's do another shot. Like this is gonna be fun. Like love that for me. Cause I was trying not to drink like vodka because the vodka there is apparently like methanol, which is like nearly petrol or something. As I went to swallow, it literally just went spraying out of my mouth. My body literally rejected this shot. I could not physically swallow it. I full thought I was going to, as I went to, my body literally rejected it. It went everywhere. There was like luckily a big gap behind me. It went, <laughs> it literally sprayed out like a hose. It was so embarrassing actually I didn't really care and then I had to get napkins and clean it all up and people were like oh my god and I was like fuck I'm gonna get kicked out but then I realized I don't think people really get kicked out in Bali so that was like 
I was like, oh, okay, obviously I cannot drink anymore. Like, that was not normal that that just happened. I've never sprayed my shot out on the floor in front of everyone ever. I'm like, okay, this is, like, getting, like, to a point where, like, I, I just need to relax. So, yeah, that, that is what happened that night, which is why I didn't keep vlogging because, holy shit, it was just crazy. Um, and then, yeah, we come home. The next day, we just got, like, heaps of massages and stuff. And then um, I ended up going to Perth for a few days to hang out with Rani because she wasn't there, like, in Bali for too long because she went home for her birthday. So I went to Rani's. The night I got to Rani's house, I literally got Bali Belly when I got to Perth. So I was like, yeah, like, can't wait to hang out with Rani. 10 p.m. comes around. I'm like, Rani, I don't feel good. And I literally, I, I just got hot flushes all over my body. Peanut is, like, so dramatic. Sit, boy. Sit. Stay. I got hot flashes all over my body and I ran to the toilet and I just vomited everywhere and Riley was like, oh my God, like that was so much vomit. I literally power spewed three times. Like it was like, it was like five vomits, but like three were like, bleh. like literally it was honestly, oh, I've never vomited that much in my life. And the thing that really annoyed me was that it was like cheese and bacon shapes and they're like my favorite. So I can never, I can never eat them ever again. It was like a million different sicknesses going around the group. So I wasn't hundred percent sure what one I had, but I think it was a 24 hour bug mixed with barley belly because my belly is so sore and then it lasted for 24 hours really bad. I'm still not feeling amazing, but I definitely have a lot more energy than what I did. You should have seen me. I was like, when I was um, in the bathroom, Marnie's like, you vomit just like me. And I was like, how? And she's like, you just like nearly cry. You're like, because <laughs> you literally want someone to help you, but like you can't because you're so sick and you just know that the only thing that can, like the only way you're going to feel better is just like waiting it out. So it was like I was in labor, honestly. I'm kidding. But yeah, I finally got back home to Melbourne this morning at 5 a.m. I got on a really early flight and yeah, now I'm back in Melbourne. My lounge um, arrived while I was gone because my brother house sits and looks after the dogs while I'm gone, which was amazing because if I didn't have my brother to do it, I literally don't know what I would do. I probably just wouldn't be able to travel. So I'm glad I have someone that I trust doing that. Um, but yeah, I'm super happy to be home and filming again. Filming this vlog really just put me back in the mindset of wanting to film just like... I mean, I've spoke about a lot of things on my channel. Obviously, I don't get into detail, but over the past few months, it's just been so negative online, and I've just been so... I've just... The last thing I wanted to do was film, and I didn't have any creative drive in me because of all this shit that was just happening online. I'm just so over it. Like, I don't fucking care about drama. I can't deal with it. Like, moving forward now, like, I'm just... I'm just done with it. Like, I... Tommy singing downstairs. I just want nothing but positivity in my life. I've always been like that. Anyone that's going to be negative on any of my shit, talk about other people, bring other people into my business. I'm just, I'm just going to block them because I, I just can't deal with it. We're not fucking 12. We're not, we're not in high school. You know what I mean? Like I'm not here for it. All I'm here for is to make you guys laugh, make you guys happy, distract you guys from your life if that's what you want. Cause that's definitely why I watch YouTube a lot of the time. I'm really happy with like the people that are in my life right now very content and I'm super excited to bring you guys some like new videos and some exciting different things. First time I'm really going to be filming properly in Melbourne is going to be this week so I'm super motivated and I feel great about it. The last videos I've been doing I mean I've just been kind of like fuck I need to film I need to film I want you guys to like see content and I've been posting it and like it's been fun and stuff but I haven't been consistent and that's what I love doing I love being consistent and always posting so I feel like going away on that trip and just being around so many of my close friends um really just made me feel just normal again and like I don't know I guess the move really like threw me off a bit because I was like fuck moving like routines and everything I was just like trying to figure out like what my routine was and like who I was like hanging around and like it was just so new for me so it was a bit scary but now I finally feel like back to normal like I think because my lounge is here that's why I feel normal <laughs> I'm kidding. I just, yeah, I just was with some amazing people and it just made me realize like, fuck. I got my hair done again. I went to Circles in Perth. They're honestly incredible. Look how good it looks. I got it curled yesterday. Actually, was it? Ye yeah, yesterday. And it's still curly. That's literally never happened. My hair does not hold curls. Wow, I've been talking for so long. I'm so sorry. Anyways, I just want you guys to know like the last bit of that trip because it was literally so funny. Um, me and Tommy are just cooking burgers now. Anyways, this is my new couch. Super cute. I'm very hungry and very excited. Anyways, guys, I'm gonna head off and have my dinner. So thank you for watching my vlog. I love you guys so much. That lighting is absolutely disgusting. But yeah, make sure you give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Um, my boots are itchy, sorry. But yeah, I love you guys.